Here are the top 10 richest Igbo youths in Nigeria in 2024. The Igbos are considered the richest tribe in Nigeria, and its youths are not relenting, making money moves, owning super luxurious cars, mansions, and sitting on top of board of directors of well known multinational high profile companies. So today, we'll be revealing the top 10 richest Igbo youths in Nigeria in 2024, their net worth, cars, mansions, businesses, and many more. So if you are new to this channel, do well, sit back, and relax, and don't forget to subscribe and Click on the notification bell icon so you can be notified whenever we drop new videos. And remember, we only drop interesting, educating, and exciting content. Welcome to Cheesy Media. Number 10 on the list today is nobody but Linus Williams with an estimated net worth of 20 billion naira. Linus Williams, who is popularly known as B Lord or Bitcoin Lord, is a tech guru, entrepreneur, philanthropist, and a crypto trader. B Lord is from Ebenebe in Anambra State, Nigeria. He is known for living a luxurious and flamboyant lifestyle, owning several luxurious cars and mansions. B Lord made headlines when he was arrested and accused of fraud by the EFCC, which he later defeated them in court and recovered his cars and was paid huge compensation for false accusation. Since then, he has grown to become one of the biggest crypto traders in Africa, also innovating and creating several business applications and apps such as Big Billpoint, JetPay, Famous App, and BitShop. B-Lord has several luxurious and exotic mansions in Anambra State. He owns three luxurious mansions in Anambra State that is reportedly worth over 5 billion naira. B-Lord has an estimated net worth of 20 billion naira. Number 9 on the list today is nobody but Kubana Chief Priest with an estimated net worth of 25 billion naira. Kubana Chief Priest, who is also known as Ezemu or the Celebrity Barman, is an entertainer, a club owner, influencer, and a politician. His real name is Pascal Chibike Okechuku. He hails from Imo State, Nigeria. Kubana Chief Priest started up as one of Ubi Kubana club managers in his one of his club in Imo State in Owere, where he gradually made a name for himself through his influence and also through the influence of one of the biggest artists in Africa, David O. He worked for Ubi Kubana for five years before leaving the Kubana brand and starting his own club, The Shrine. And today, he owns two massive clubs, one in Owere, Imo State, and also a bigger one in Asaba. Delta State, Nigeria. Kubana Chief Priest owns a lot of luxurious and exotic cars, from a Rolls Royce to a Mercedes Benz G Wagon and also many more. He owns a luxurious mansion in his hometown in Owere. The mansion is reportedly worth over 2 billion naira. <laughs> Number 8 on the list today is engineer Francis Mwagogo, who is also known as Vintage Interior with an estimated net worth of 30 billion naira. Vintage Interior, who is also known as Mwachi Nemere, is an entrepreneur, a businessman, and the CEO of Vintage Interior, one of the biggest and most luxurious interior designers in the whole of Nigeria. Engineer Francis hails from Mbise in Imo State, Nigeria, and he also deals on real estate with the likes of Ubi Kubana, Imoni, and many more. He is a major shareholder in Ubi Kubana's company, the Kubana Group. He also has a major shares in Ubi Kubana's brands such as Odogu Peters and Odogu Hammer. On the 26th December 2023, he opened one of the most luxurious mansions in Imo State, in his hometown in Mbise. He, he called this mansion the Vintage Manor. This mansion is a true definition of luxury, comfort, and high taste. The mansion has a football pitch, a swimming pool, a cinema room, a gym house, a walk-in closet, five sitting rooms, and eight bedroom. This is a true definition of luxury. Man 
like Chico, whose real name is Chibuzo Madboko. He is the son of a renowned businessman and billionaire chief Benson Madboko, who hails from Adaziani in Anambra State, Nigeria. Man like Chico is the managing director of his father's business empire, the Chico Group, a conglomerate that deals in all kinds of building materials from rooftops, stone tiles, granite doors, and many more. Man like Chico is known for living a luxurious and flamboyant lifestyle. He loves showing off his expensive and luxurious cars. His car collection is definitely going to blow your mind. He owns a Lamborghini Avatando, a Lamborghini Urus, a Ferrari, a Springer, a Mercedes-Benz G-Wagon, a Mercedes-Benz Maybach, and many more. On the 24th December 2023, he opened his luxurious mansion in Portacourt, River State. This mansion is a true definition of luxury. The mansion itself is said to be worth over 4 billion naira. Yokonkwo is a renowned businessman, real estate mugu, and an oil magnet. He hails from Ojoto in Anambra State, Nigeria. Kennedy Okonkwo is one of the biggest real estate dealers in Lagos, with over 20 successful multi billion naira estates. He is the CEO of Netcom Oz Limited, a conglomerate that deals in oil and gas and real estate development. His Victoria Crest home is one of the biggest estates in Lagos. Kennedy Okonkwo owns a lot of expensive and luxurious cars and mansions, both in Lagos and in his hometown in Ojoto in Anambra State. JC, Chukuma and Joko with an estimated net worth of 37 billion naira. Jason Chukuma is a young entrepreneur, businessman, and philanthropist. He is the CEO of Iroko TV and Rock Studios. Iroko TV is an online Nollywood movie streaming platform. Jason Njoko, who was born and raised in Southeast London but moved down to Nigeria with his business idea to start up the Iroko TV brand from the comfort of his bedroom. Today, the company has expanded to own several channels both in GoTV and DSTV and also in Sky in the UK. Jason Njoko is married to Nollywood actress Mary Remy Njoko. Joe Wizaza with an estimated net worth of 55 billion naira. Joe Wizaza, whose real name is Joseph Okafor Jr., he hails from Ekulobia in Anambra State, Nigeria. Joe Wizaza is the first son of Igbo billionaire and oil magnate Chief Joseph Eze Okafor, the founder of Jesco Oil and Lubricant. The young billionaire has taken over the father's company and empire and has been successful running the family business. Joe Wizaza has a taste of rich and flamboyant lifestyle. His expensive lifestyle is way more higher than a lot of our Nigerian celebrities such as David o, Whiskey, Bonaboy and the rest of them. He owns a lot of expensive and luxurious cars. He owns a Lamborghini Avatado, a Lamborghini Urus, a Ferrari, a Rolls Royce Cullinan, a Bentley and many more. Joe Wizaza owns several luxurious mansions both in Lagos, Abuja and in his hometown in the Colombia in Anambra State. He owns a luxurious mansion in the most expensive estate in Lagos, Banana Island, Lagos. The mansion is said to be worth over 6 billion naira. Joe Wizaza loves expensive and luxurious cars. His car collection is definitely going to blow your mind. His car collection alone is said to be worth over 5 billion naira. E-Money with an estimated net worth of 58 billion naira. E-Money, whose real name is Emeka Okonkwo, is a young entrepreneur, a business tycoon, and also a philanthropist. E-Money is the CEO of a shipping company that deals in exportation and importation of goods and services, the Emi Cargos Limited, and also Five Star Group, a conglomerate that consists of Five Star Music. 5 star transportation, 5 star tomatoes, 5 star oil and gas, and many more. E Money, as his name implies, is known for living an exotic and flamboyant lifestyle. He owns several expensive and luxurious cars. He owns two Rolls Royce Phantom, a Mercedes Benz Maybach, a Bentley, a Mercedes Benz G Wagon, and many more. He owns several luxurious and expensive mansions, both in Lagos and his hometown in Anambra State. And his mansions are all the interior of his mansions, all the furniture in his mansion are all imported and good plated. The mansions are reportedly worth over 8 billion naira. Number 2 on the list today is nobody but Obi Kubana with an estimated net worth of 65 billion naira. 
Obi Kubana, whose real name is Obina Ihebu, is an entrepreneur, businessman, and philanthropist. He hails from Oba in Anambra State, Nigeria. He's the CEO of the Kubana Group, a conglomerate that deals in clubs, hotels, real estate, restaurants, wines, and many more. He is regarded as the king of nightlife and hospitality. Obi Kubana is really famous after he hosted one of the biggest burial ceremonies in Nigeria when he buried his mother in Oba in Anambra State. Obi Kubana owns more than seven nightclubs scattered all over Nigeria, hotels, real estate, and many more. He is also the CEO of Odogu Bitas and Dogu Hama. He owns several luxurious and expensive cars from a Rolls Royce to a Bentley to a G Wagon and many more. He owns a palace home in Abuja. This mansion is reportedly worth over 5 billion naira and also owns an exotic one in his hometown in Oba in Anambra State. Number one on the list today is going to surprise a lot of people, but he is the biggest and the richest Igbo youth in Nigeria. His name is Stanley Ugochukwu with an estimated net worth of 70 billion naira. Stanley Ugochukwu is a young Nigerian entrepreneur, oil magnet, businessman, and philanthropist. He hails from Nnewi in Anambra State, Nigeria. Mr. Stanley is the CEO of a Stanel Group, a conglomerate that specializes in oil and gas, automobile spare parts, production and distribution. He is also the owner of the Chicken Republic brand in the entire Southeast. He employs over 1,000 youths scattered all over the country. In July 2017, he commissioned his ultra modern mega gas plant station in Oka. The gas plant is said to be worth over 10 billion naira. Stanley Ugochuku has an estimated net worth of 70 billion naira. In also last year December, he commissioned his one of his most expensive hotels in Lagos State. This hotel is a true definition of luxury and high taste. His friends such as Obi Kuban and Imoni visited this expensive and luxurious hotel. The hotel is a true definition of class. The hotel is said to be worth over 10 billion naira. Stanley has an estimated net worth of 70 billion naira. Okay guys, drop a comment below. Tell me what to think about it. What do you think should be on the list? And don't forget to subscribe, like, and share.